Today we're making crepes. First, you're going to add flour and salt into a bowl. Then you're going to add a cup of milk. Then whisk all together. Next, one at a time, crack in two eggs into the bowl. Whisk each one individually. You'll take your butter and you'll melt it like so. Then we'll add in some sugar, add in your melted butter, and add in half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Whisk that up like so, and then you want to cover it and put it in your fridge to cool and rest for approximately one hour. When, you, when your hour passes, melt some butter in a skillet over medium high heat. Take a scoop of your batter and add into the pan. You'll spread it into a thin layer and cook on one side until golden brown. Careful when you're flipping over, it might break. Then you'll cook on the other side for about another minute until it's also golden brown, like so. When it's done, you can add in whatever toppings you want and eat. So we made the crepes. That's how we did. How did you feel about them? They were pretty good. They were easy to make. Mm -hmm. And even though the first one is a little bit bad, actually the rest of them turned out because the pan was at the right temperature the second time. Yeah, the first one we made, um, it kind of broke apart. But then by like the second or third one... We were like pros. Yeah. Um, I enjoyed it because they were very sweet. Very They're not overpowering in any way. Very tasty. Yeah. Um, and again, like super easy to make. You just throw everything together, um, as you just saw, in a bowl, and then cover it, then cook it. Um, are there any types of toppings you'd like to try again in the future? Maybe whipped cream. Oh, that would have been really good to have um, whipped cream with it. Maybe whipped cream or maple syrup. That might be good. Mm, like just drizzling the maple syrup? Or yes. like Yeah, just a drizzle. Not infusing it? Maybe chocolate and whipped cream, just a drizzle of chocolate. Mm -hmm. Would you put any, um, like, nuts on it? No, I don't think so. No sliced almonds or anything? No, not that would be for me. See, I think I might try that. Um, in the past, like, I've had some different crepes. Like, I've had, like, savory ones, like, with a ratatouille in them, but I haven't had a lot of sweet crepes. So this was a very fun experience to share with you. Thank you. Well, thank you. I had fun. To me, it sounds like you had fun. Yeah. So a uh, good time had by all. And it was fun taking the photos. I was worried at times that I might end up dropping um, the camera into the batter, which would have really sucked. Well, that would have been, wouldn't have been nice at all. Yeah. So. No, it was easy to do it. We'll have to make it again. I, I saved the recipe. Yeah, that's a keep recipe. Mm -hmm. There's not lots of times where you find a recipe that's super good. And um, I, was I was very surprised because on the website where I got this recipe from, it says that it was an intermediate one, but um, we, we seem to finesse it pretty good. Yeah, I don't think that there's any troubles at all. Well, thank you, and good luck in the kitchen. Let's have... Uh, Shall we go eat some more crepes? I think that would be a oh. good idea. Let's go. Or happy mushroom.